Five advantages of e-learning that we've discovered after two years of pandemic. My name is Max Quiroz from Max and Wood Training and welcome to this video. Yes, who would have guessed that after two years of pandemic that today we would be recording a video talking about e-learning and still talking about the pandemic. We thought but that by this time, pandemic would be a thing of the past. However, we're still seeing lots of uh, sub-variants of the COVID-19 virus. We're seeing uh, critical peaks on, on contagions. So it is important to emphasize that e-learning is here to stay. And after two almost more than two years of pandemic, we've learned lots of things. And there's five advantages that today we want to share with you. Those five advantages of e-learning that we've discovered after two years of pandemic. So let's go on to uh, talk about those five advantages. And the first one has to do with time. E-learning allows us to manage our time in a very efficient way. Why is that? Because we can access our learning whenever we have time available. It can be when we're waiting at an airport or late at night after our kids are, have gone to sleep or uh, at lunch break, for example. Whenever there's a free time, we can access our learning experience. And that is very important because before this, whenever we had uh, a training course or, an, or a, an academic course or whatever kind of learning experience, there was a time frame that we must cover. There was a set schedule that we should uh, adhere to. And this is very important. With e-learning, especially in an asynchronous mode, we can participate, we can take advantage of that learning experience at whatever times are more convenient to us. Yes, there are models, there are examples of e-learning where there's a synchronous uh, component where we should meet on a Zoom meeting or Teams, uh, Microsoft Teams meeting with the instructor or, or, or teacher. And then we have to be there at that time live in the live session. But most of the time we can access most of the resources whenever it's most convenient for us. So that's advantage number one for e-learning and this Many people are very happy with this. Many people are really taking advantage of this because they can study, they can learn whenever they have time available. That's advantage number one. The next thing is, uh, is a wonderful thing. Commuting is no longer a problem. Whenever we had face-to-face -face trainings or courses, we had to go to the training venue. Maybe it was in the same city that uh, where we live, and then, well, we had to drive or take public transport to that venue and attend the course and then go back to our work or, to, or go back home. But if, if, if it was a more, uh, in a bigger scale, what happened? For example, if we wanted to attend a Tony Robbins uh, course or event, we had to book a flight, we have to book our, our, our hotel and then meals at, when we were uh, away from home or from work and we weren't able to work, we weren't able to be with our loved ones. So this is hard. Believe me, I, I did it many times, both as a participant and as instructor, where you had to travel lots of to uh, a lot to be able to participate in different training events and it's hard for you. What happens with e-learning? There's no commute. You can attend from the comfort of your own living room or the space that you have adapted for uh, 
to your Zoom meetings in your Zoom room or whatever you call it. And this is very important because you don't have to, uh, expenses are reduced. The time that you lose commuting to an event is, is great. It, it's a, a great cost of, of participating in that event. So with e-learning, we abolish commute and this is something wonderful because we can in our case as instructors we can put our our courses for everybody to participate and we can attend whatever courses online courses that are available for us so this is very very uh helpful for us and for many people that's advantage number two another thing is that e-learning is similar to other new realities. Our in entertainment is online. We go to Netflix, Prime Video, HBO, or whatever streaming platform you want, and then you consume your entertainment through uh, technology. We buy online. Yes, e-commerce has uh, experience a, a, an exponential growth during this pandemic and this is because we were confined we were uh confined to our homes and we we weren't able to go to the local supermarket or we weren't able to go shopping to shopping malls so we had to buy everything online and now we can also study and learn online and this is something that it's very, very similar to other things, other realities that we are experiencing right now. We are, we're used to interacting with other people through social media, WhatsApp, Messenger, Twitter, LinkedIn, whatever platform you're using, you're used to interacting with people online. Why can't we learn online? So now, e-learning is taking advantage of that and it's great for us because if we do all other all uh, those other things online why not e-learning and that's advantage number three now before we go on to the next advantages i would like to remind you if you haven't done so Click on the subscribe button and subscribe to our channel. If you like our content, give it a thumbs up. Activate the notification bell so that you know whenever we have new content. And most important of all, leave a comment below. We love to read your comments. We love to hear from you. It, it, makes us happy and it allows us to grow because your feedback is important for us so leave a comment now let's go to uh the next uh, advantage that we found uh with e-learning and that is when when we started when this pandemic started we thought that teamwork would be hard to achieve through technology. But most of the platforms, most of the technology has evolved in such a way that it has allowed us to really work as teams online. And this is a great thing because through teamwork, we have achieved more than we had thought possible. And uh, we were in a Tony Robbins course a, a few months ago and the presenter was telling us that um, people, when they are in a face-to-face -face meeting, they feel, they're, they're, many of them are introverts and they don't like the, that kind of interaction. But when they are in an online setting, there's no pressure or they don't feel this pressure as strong as when they are face-to-face. -face. So they open up and they are able to participate much more efficiently and much more uh, truthfully than they would do in a face-to-face -face setting. So this is a great advantage because then teams can really work together, people can really work together in order to achieve some kind of goal. So it's very important. Teamwork 
has been supported by e-learning and through e-learning we learn to work in teams because you can have a team with people from different states from different cities from different countries if you want to and they will be able to collaborate in a project and or in an activity and this is a wonderful thing to see we've done it we've had courses for people from uh, colombia argentina in Mexico, United States participate in different activities, in different groups, in, 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 in an event. And this is something wonderful. The technology and e-learning really allow, help us to uh, work as a team. So that's advantage number four. And finally, e-learning helps to develop responsibility. Yes, uh, many uh, universities like Monterey Tech in Mexico have moved to a model where the teacher or the instructor is not the owner of knowledge. He is a facilitator of the learning process, of the student's learning process. So whenever you move to that kind of model, the only person responsible for his or her learning is a participant. The participant must be responsible for his or her own learning. And e-learning makes this very clear. Because there's no teacher that's looking after you. There's no teacher or, 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 or a principal that is looking after you and telling you you must go into your session and you must study and you must participate and you must do the activities. You know that you have to do it by yourself. You know that you are responsible of going to the session. You are responsible of, of, of using the materials that are online, of, of going through all the materials, all the activities, and of achieving, going through the different activities until you achieve a certain goal or objective. And this is when you become responsible. This makes you responsible. So e-learning really develops uh, responsibility. And that's advantage number five. So those are the five advantages or some five uh, five advantages because there's many more advantages of e-learning that we've learned about and if you are enrolled in moving from traditional or face-to-face -face learning to e-learning we have a surprise for you we have a gift for you click the link in the description of this video or go to the url that you're seeing on your screen right now and download a checklist for your e-learning course, your online course. It's a checklist that will guide you on all the aspects that you must take into consideration to develop a successful e-learning or online course. We really hope this video has been helpful for you. Hope to see you in the next one. Have a great day.